Good morning, New Hope. Pastor John for another edition of Daily Hope. I'm reading from Romans 8 and verse 35. Who shall separate us from the love of Christ? Shall trouble or hardship, persecution or famine or nakedness or danger or sword? Knowing all these things, we are more than conquerors through him who loved us. For I am convinced that neither death nor life Neither angels nor demons, neither the present nor the future, nor any powers, neither height nor depth, nor anything else in all of creation will be able to separate us from the love of God that is in Christ Jesus our Lord. I mean, what a great truth. Nothing so separate us from the love of Christ. And there's a lot in there. There's a lot of hard things, life, death, uh, demonic powers. So if nothing can separate us, then there's nothing greater. And I love Anselm uh, in church history. His definition of God is that which nothing greater can be thought. There's nothing greater than the love of Christ. And so when we go against those hard things, when we go against uh, evil things in this world, we don't want to focus so much on those things because they're nothing compared to the love of Christ. Nothing can separate us. So whenever we're doing freedom prayer or things come up of evil presence and praying over homes, praying over hard things in people's lives, praying over uh, evil strongholds in their lives, we don't focus so much on those things. We take authority in Jesus' name, but we focus on the love of Christ. We're not demon hunting here or, or focusing on demonology or any of that kind of thing. We want people to have freedom in Christ, but we focus on that which nothing greater can be thought. So just grow in that. Just keep putting the focus on Jesus. Keep coming to him. He's the one who gives us rest. He's the one who gives us freedom. He's the one who gives us life and perfect peace. Would you pray with me? Heavenly Father, we just thank you for this this awesome truth that nothing in this world, nothing in the heavens, nothing anywhere can separate us from the love of Christ. If we surrender to you, and if we receive that and and walk in that, nothing can separate us. So just touch each one this day what they need to grow in that love, to, to marvel in that love, to stand on that love, and to just command anything not of the Lord Jesus to go in in your mighty name. We love you, Lord Jesus, and we'll give you all the praise and glory in your mighty name. Amen. Thanks so much. Have a wonderful day.